Alright, hey guys, what's up? It's Volk, your one and only. How am my adventure doing? Yeah, I know. I know. I've been away from the game for, like, a week? Two weeks? How long has it been? A little bit too long. <laughs> I'd say I just recently spoke with my uh, game developer. And we're getting everything situated. Everything is nearly almost done. So, yeah, that my bad. <laughs> I didn't think it would actually like take that long to get everything situated, but it did. Ah, so it's it's one of those back and forth things that I'm dealing with because he only talks to me once a day. I think he's on a time crunch type of situation right now, but he has, actually has a little time when he is available. So things like that. Things of that nature. Which is fine. It gives me more time to get my other stuff situated, so... You know, that's good. I'm just happy that I haven't ran out of, like, certain buffs or anything. Like, all my buffs are paused as long as I'm offline. So that's good. Except for the, um, probably the gyms, the, uh, what are they called? These. Maybe less of these are exception. But yeah, I've been out of it. Now I gotta remember where I last left off. I think we defeated the condemned mines, right? Yeah, we defeated condemned mines, so now we gotta go do this sooner or later. I have no TP stuff. So that's not going to do anything. Uh... Guess we can go to... To this. My brain and knowledge does not hold anymore. <laughs> because I've been out of it for so long. Now I'm going to remember where everything is. Crazy, huh? Okay, yeah, it's probably force. Is it not? Is it actually in the city? Oh, no. It is here. Because we quested outside of it. Totally forgot about that. But yeah, I, was, I woke up a little bit early to try and get a video. Well, try to get, you know, some stuff in. Small little recording session. to myself I might as well just you know get in the video that I can get off work and come back here and start editing the only reason I'm collecting all the quests in the overworld is because they give gold and other resources so it's kind of it's kind of needed to do overworld stuff too because they give so many good resources like those scrolls that we just got and i feel like they'll give more towards like crafting weapons later on as we go who knows if it can be easier or harder um oh yeah she was down there right i think i just passed her yeah there she is 
Hey buddy, how you doing? Can I have... Where is it? Yeah, there it is. So yeah, I do apologize for my very long absence. Oh uh, yeah, I keep forgetting they... Nobody in the private server touches the, the books for some reason. The quills. Quill quests. Which throws me off so much. Oh, there he is. I gotta change out some skills, but... Because I didn't even put those on. I just hopped on and, uh... Ignored all that. Visibility, my... Ambush. Hold on, gotta change this out. Okay, we're good. Uh, where's Gorilla Form? Oh, yeah, I forgot. That's all Gorilla Form starts out with. Gorilla Form doesn't start out with, like, a... Points. It's like um, an ability that gives you a point on the start. Forgot about that. So it's kind of difficult for them to like start out. I mean, they're mostly used for like tanking for like the start of it. Uh, what weapon are we on? Okay. Before it is, I haven't been on to uh, update any of my stuff I was crafting. <laughs> been gone off that too. So I gotta remember where I last stopped crafting. Which is, which just became a fucking headache now. Because <laughs> I gotta figure that out. What's going on here? A lot of, uh, headaches. Well, pet crystals. Um, I'm not sure if they did the same thing as um, Graphitasia Memories. I doubt it. But Memories has found their own little gimmick now. And they've been going along with that, the transformations and uh, pet summons. I am interested to see like an actual pet system instead of a uh, Grand Fantasia. It's been a while. I actually should have checked and see if they've done any updates before I actually like hopped on. Let me do that right now, actually, because I'm I'm curious of what they've been up to. God, their website. Crap, refresh page. Ah, the website on their uh, launcher is still Window Explorer. I don't know why they have not changed that, which is still fucking annoying <laughs> because it, that. Window Explorer always bugs out now and then, so it's, like, really annoying to get, like, 
any information of what's going on. Uh, their last update was the 23rd. I think I've already seen the 23rd, right? Okay, no. Because I missed it's 26. No, not 26. Uh, 16. Of this uh, month. Okay, they're doing an event on the 16th one. And they're still releasing costumes, item, mall stuff. Nothing all that unique. Let's see what's going on on the 23rd. Alright, some key updates. They just fixed a couple of things, like Archive. That's pretty much it. And they released new item all stuff that's related to, like, checkers. <laughs> is what it looks like. They, they didn't really do anything, like, phenomenal yet. Did I miss the knife? Okay, no, that's the knife, uh, which we actually talked about them, like, actually updating our archive. Yep, they haven't really done anything, uh, special. Just the same old stuff. It was shocking, actually. Was I crafting a hammer? I think I was. I think I was trying to get up to a decent hammer. And there really aren't any decent hammers starting off. Well, at least for Druid, there isn't any decent hammer starting off. So what I'm going to do... These are... No, they're not the training ones. Uh, I guess I'll just start doing these one at a time. Get the staffs going, too. Guess that's what we're going to do for now. Oh, yeah, I needed to catch up my gear. Don't you cry to me. Go back to work. As of right now, there's nothing else to craft. Because I'll end up being out of range the next time I craft. Well, no. Probably not. At least I think so. Maybe I will? Oh, yeah, I was trying to craft the rings. That's what I was last doing. But I was trying to figure out, like, which... Like, which thing am I going for? Am I going for physical... For magic damage. I think I might go for physical for now. So I'm going to go collect. Oh, well, I actually can't collect anything. Right now, because I set my sprites out to grab other stuff. So I guess what we're going to do is start bringing up cave. Sounds like a better idea. That's right now. He's doing cape stuff. Oh yeah. If I'm offline, it also pauses this too, so... Do this. So now I'll cape. I'd say, please don't fill on any requests right now. That's the last thing we need, guys. I mean, the XP is pretty decent in the overworld, even though I, I'm, like, out level this area. So it's not too bad, is what I want to say. 
think we just completed that book also. Yeah. Okay, that actually gave me some decent XP. Need you to go collect some some of these. Some food boxes. I say, like, why are they closing? Yeah, they close. Okay, they're closing because I'm going down to the other sprites. Do I need to? Okay, now. I mean, just making sure every swift dragon is extinct over here. I guess we're going to focus on this screen for a while. On these uh, three. Until they're at least 31. For some reason, I can't click on it. But yeah, I wanted to get on and keep questing. Because we gotta keep questing and getting gold so we don't get like far behind on. Crafting, because you guys gotta remember, crafting starts to get very expensive later on. But what else? Getting like to go is not as as bad. Not to go. Wait, did I say two gold? Uh, five gold. As we're getting five gold, is like keeping us at a healthy thing. So I would say. Complete a zone. Go do your quests. Well, you're... <clears throat> it's sort of like this. I say, as soon as you start inside of it, like a city of your choice, it's like area of your choice. Complete blue. Complete uh, Castle Isle Plains. Then do a Perry Cave. Then after Perry Cave, you go to, you know, Sprite Forest. Then after you beat Surprise Forest, you complete the next dungeon. Then after you complete that dungeon, then you would go to the next area, complete that. Then go to the next dungeon, complete that, and then go to the next dungeon. It's just the best way at the moment that I see is going to keep you healthy inside of the goat situation and resources that they drop. As of now. So just keep that in mind. That it's just a lot better that way. Or at least it seems a lot better that way. 
But I guess we'll find out now that I'm uh, playing again. This this is also another good reason of why to come out here and do these too. Because dungeon rushing is out of here since you level so fast will actually ruin you very very fast. It seems just seems that way. Unless you can, I would say unless you can like actually build immediately afterwards. I was say my only thought on that is, okay, I gotta go to branches soon. But my only thought process on that is that if you're gonna make a new character, dungeon rushing is a thing. If you already have like a main who has the resources to bring up your new character. That'll only be my other thought of that. You have, like, I mean, you could send all the resources over to. My only thought is, man, we should have a share bank at this point. Like, there's no reason for Grand Fantasia not to have a share bank yet. Especially with the items that you can't trade. But you get but you would need to send to other characters that would, you know, benefit from it more. Like let's say the level the blue level uh eighty uh accessories you get from you get from Spire. Now say you need those. But if you're level 100 already, and already you probably already have like way better stuff for it, which is you know the issue of that. That's why the share bank would be so great, just because you can hand those trinkets over to you know characters who actually need it, because they'll be, because those are untradeable. Well, not untradeable. If you use it by mistake, or you know use it until like a certain point to where you don't need it anymore it wouldn't just be taking up room because you can't archive it that's the sad thing about you know that is that you can't archive it even though it is like a special trinket or a special accessory or a unique accessory i guess that would be the better word no no that's the Crap. I never do those level 15 gimmicks. I, I don't know why. It's just. Seems like a pain in the ass. To even think about. Oh yeah. The Raptor book is done. Yeah. The rewards inside of. The quill are still terrible. I gotta get some new areas for that. Ugh. That's gonna be annoying. Yeah, we can go there. And now we're getting up into level 30 hammers. So I got to pass that for the better ones.
Okay, so... Where are we at on the jewels here? Okay, so we need six more. So we're gonna be on that for quite a while. I think we should be good. I say I gotta remember that the difficulty is not as it's not as high as um, memories. This is like standard grand potato now. I haven't really been keeping up with what a lot of what memories and Violet have been doing since I've been gone because I've been like very focused on everything I've been doing. So I gotta kind of catch up and see everything that they're doing. Like later on. As of right now, I just don't want to spend too much time looking at what they're doing because I want to, you know, finish all these quests. Well, at least get a video out is what I should say. That's why I mostly want to focus on getting the video out. Updating you guys that I'm I'm back on the grind for at least a while, to be honest. Actually, for a long while with how it's going right now. Because we're on the combat system of my game. So, it's, so we're pretty much good right now. It shouldn't be too much trouble. I'll say the only things, other things I'll have to do this week is, oh crap, uh, yeah, the only other things I'd have to do this week is get mono ready for the next Monster Girl design. I'll say they're taking a the two day break, so, well, they would take the two day break like a while ago. But they'll get back to me. They normally get back to me as soon as they get back. So I'm not going to rush it. So it's all good. Oh yeah, that's the transition quest, isn't it? Yeah, that's Plague Forest. We can turn that off. I guess we could start traveling. Because I think we should be situated. Uh, we can craft that jewel now, right? We got to craft gentle. Oh, yeah. I have to go all the way back to the older ones. Because this, this sprite is going to be a little bit iffy. Now this is at level 31. Oh, yeah, the moon staff. Yeah. I don't think we need it. Right now. I think we're good. I thought one of them was here. Are they all in Kazla? Yeah, they're all in Kazla. Okay. Kazla. Uh, okay. And so I remember where Jessica was. And I was trying to remember. It was like, who are these guys again? <laughs> now Jessica's just right here. So I might as well talk to her before we go down there. Because she's a lot closer.
Really? As soon as I get you up, you fell. You're a dick for that. I just want you to know. Okay, we're going to take a break and get some foraging in. So we can start getting ready for our, uh, bringing up ease more. Okay, so now we go all the way back. It's interesting because I... Whoops. My alarm. Since I woke up early. But it's interesting because I think I'm seeing more people like... Dungeon Rush at the moment. So they either have a character already prepared, or they're not worried about it. Oh yeah, I do have mining over here too. Might as well uh, join in on that. Is that extra 200 is actually going to be doing something? Uh, yeah, go back. I guess we're ready. I guess we can actually go grab our crab because it's actually it's actually not hard to get. I was easy. He spawns in two areas. It's either right here. Oh, yeah, there he is. I say either spawns here or over here in this area. The only thing I can say at the moment is like the only way you would uh, actually utilize your yeah, good thing I had to turn it off. The only way, the best way to utilize your charms in this game is the only way and use them inside of dungeons. I think that's the only way to maximize them because if you're doing the strat that I'm doing, the best way to maximize them would be dungeons. But if you were to do it like, you know, just, well, yeah, yeah. the only place you would have to use them is dungeons, actually. Because if you come out and overworld it, you wouldn't really get, like, too much from these enemies. So, uh, since we have those, uh, go back. And start collecting... Oh, yeah, wood. Go back and start collecting wood so we can start raising these more. And as for you, we're going to see if you actually craft the ring we need. Oh god, we're going to need more of those, I just realized. Hopefully it lets us wear two oranges. It should. It shouldn't. It shouldn't stop us. Because that would be two golds that would... Uh, that goes two yellow items. That should stop us. Because it seems like these trinkets are actually a really, really good damage spike compared to normal. Yeah, it actually is a good damage spike because because you never have um, accessories that actually give you damage. They're all defense. So this accessory sprite is actually, like, really freaking good. Oh, Clark, yeah. Ah, uh, apparently there's a enemy here. What was that?
Okay, cool. And now we can make Night Whisper. Question is... Like, what else can we get ourselves into here? Because we need Hero Cape. And we need this. So, okay. So it's both... So I need both of them to get, like, actual physical out of it. Which shouldn't be hard. Uh, this one needs actual, like, cords. That should actually be extremely easy if you actually succeed on that. Unless I'm going to have to, you know, treat it as a low rate item to build. Start building ports. That I don't know why I thought that was Charles. I was like, wait a minute, he's in, he's inside of a dungeon. We're gonna need you to join in on this. As for you, ah, uh, yeah, we're gonna need you to join in too. You have Minecraft thing too? Yeah, you do. Uh, join in. Did you do it? Okay, nice. So we got some good stats out of that. Oh, you can actually awaken it too. It's another interesting thing. Okay. So let's see. You. Yeah, that's all you need. What about your silent one? The silent one needs. Okay, so that that's gonna be very easy to get to. So I guess we'll do that grab next. But these guys are working on that. I'm going to need you to go and grab these. You too. Start shifting over a little bit. I'm getting that first. I uh, keep pushing the wrong button, that's why I'm not collecting anything. Duh. Oh crap, I didn't do the raptors. Duh. Well, I guess I can do that later. I don't think I'm going to have to come back over here, maybe. Maybe.
I guess, yeah, I guess right now we would have you on cape duty. Because I feel like the next stage of Trinkets is going to be a pretty big jump in level. So I'm not going to worry about the next stage. I'm just trying to get my physical stuff out of it. I think he went over there. So, yeah, he's right there. Okay. Make sure I just don't auto run into him. I had a quartz. Forget about that. These. Oh, you failure. Um, but there we go. Of course, you would fail that. There's your old cape, though. So we're good on that. Oh God, you need that? Okay. Well then, all right. Fuck it, I'll take it. Guess we'll get the silent ring done. Do we have everything for Breeze? No, we don't. We're off by three. So I need you guys to go back and grab, start grabbing those now. I think I already have three on them, so that should be fine. I guess I would need you back on getting your foraging up at the moment. Let's do a clean east quest since we're closer. Now we're going to turn on a one then. What? I was about to say, wait a minute. We don't go there. What are you, where are you going, game? That's done. Then the rest of these should be done soon. I can't open these now. There they are. Those are done. So technically I can make the cape now. Because I do have it crafted, right? Oh, no, I don't. I thought I did. No, I did not. So we'll, we'll craft that cape in a few seconds. Um, at the moment, what we're going to do is craft this. Because I need to know if I'm going to have to 
start scavenging more. Actually, do gotta keep an eye out more with the boss in this area. I actually don't remember he he goes into the crater or not. I think he stays on the outside of it. I just don't want to risk it because we cannot kill that thing at the level we are at. Yeah. Ooh. Oh, oof. Um, shit. <laughs> Bro kind of scared the hell out of me. It's like, oh, shit, no. Not like this. Alright, shit, we're done. We're done with that. Okay, so now we need the cape. Oh yeah, there is another Grand Fantasia private server that I'll be going to after this immediately. Because I, I remember that it exists. For a while, I didn't, I didn't remember it. I think it's still up. I think it should be Grand Fantasia I think craft. Which has a lot of people on it, which is well, a lot of people in their Discord. I'm not sure if it's a lot of people like actually playing it. But it seems to be like the most populated one out of all of them, from what I've seen. Well, at least I seen back then. I'm not sh like I said, I'm not sure. A lot of the servers are on and off very often they're either shut down immediately but i don't i don't think this one will i don't know i don't know really i say where do they entangle oh it is you guys you guys are all mixed up over here there we go yo dash where are you Okay, Dash has been talked to. I think that's the only quest that is over here. Other than coming back and uh, killing that knight. And now we make the heroic. Oh, damn, we didn't even get the earth stuff we needed to make the heroic. Shit, that sucks. There's a lot of stuff I gotta sell sooner or later, but at the moment I don't have the attention span for that. Oh no, there's summon boss. Oh yeah, I remember this. Don't come this way. You're coming this way, aren't you? You're gonna be that guy. Okay, use it over here. You're literally right here. Okay, so this is still messed up sometimes with different items. Okay, noted. Just because I know you're going to be that guy and attack me. So that's uh, done. I don't know if he left. Unless I wasn't paying attention. Unless somebody killed him. 
which that's fine too. I think I'll finish this, then I'll just finish the rest after work. Either that or I'll make it its own separate little video. Huh. Dear God, I... I thought... I thought it would actually give us the stuff we need. Apparently not. And this cape is actually going to be expensive. Very expensive cape. So we really won't be able to, like, dabble inside of the trinket area for a while. Because that flat 200% is actually, like, extremely freaking good. Oh, we're done. Okay, I thought there was more we had to kill. I just killed those for no reason. Probably deserved, to be honest. I had a quartz. I forgot about those. I gotta still do those. Not bad, I'm kind of multitasking at the moment. Maybe I'm not fully done with everything, but I'm, <laughs> hey, I'm, I've done enough with other things to where I can do this and multitask now. Is it actually felt great to be able to stream again? But right now we're playing streams, we're playing games that you need to grind. That's the only reason why I haven't, like, well, yesterday's stream is why I haven't, like, uh, well, yesterday I didn't decide to stream is what I'm trying to say. <laughs> Just because we would have went, like, very quiet. Because normally when we're in that grind phase, just everybody stops talking. Ah, 
No, not that. Oh yeah, and I don't think about it. Is all mounts are a hundred percent. Uh, the the bone dragon mount you get for well the combat bone dragon mount you get for reincarnating at over level eighty six I think. Well, actually, be really good. Okay, I have that done. The raptors are things I need for the book. Well, since I won't be needing this sprite for a while, I can use you as... Oh god, they did not lower the cooldown on these. I have not paid attention to that. Ooh. That that means those are useless things. Well not not useless, they're more tedious to use. Now, as for you guys, back to the good old drawing board of uh, catching up. Damn, I do not feel fast at all. <laughs> I guess when I'm transferable, but I don't, I don't feel fast. Even though I deadly am. That 100 speed is treating me just right. To where I feel like very sluggish now. But I'm actually like still pretty fast. I wonder why Violet hasn't changed like a lot of... um last skills and just left everything the same because a lot of the classes that are around inside of the main well the original some of the original classes did need help in a rework and the reworks inside of like the official server are actually like really good. Most of them. Most of them are actually really good. Surprising to say, right? Just because a lot of them. Most of them they fixed issues. Some of them they nerfed. But with Druid, we had a really, really annoying issue which most of our builds contradicted each other and it was just fixed with one little passive that converted a little bit of damage from magic into physical and a little bit of damage from physical to magic it was that passive that fixed our main issue that we had ah I thought that was him there's my second alarm <laughs> Am I killing ones? He, he was a large ape that I thought he was Diddy. Wait, isn't he the same color as these two? Dear God.
that him? No, that's not him. Why are these apes all together? This is actually going to be fucking annoying. God, I hate, I hate the gimmick quests. They make, they make everything so much fucking harder to see. Okay. Apparently I'm not over enough. Even though I was directly in that corner. Apparently another spot he spawns at is over here. Oh, it's these guys. Okay. I thought it was a boss. Not gonna lie to you, I thought it was a boss. I was looking for white text. My be. I begin to sacrifice you to the gods. Guess I should. I guess I should have thought about like. Damn, that's a lot of spawn points. <laughs> I was just looking for a big gorilla with a title over his head. <laughs> I like how they gave him a barrel. Even though it, it says the bucket is literally a barrel. Almost done with this area. All right. Done with this book. Um, honestly, I'll take the physical. Now we gotta go back to the drinks. See what they drop. Then uh, the last thing we need is the truth uh, quest chain, and then we're done with this area. Then we get um. Uh, do deserted temple, which is in what should we call it? Red Ridge, right? Oh no, re oh okay, it's that one. I'm thinking of a whole different. One. We already did that one. First try. No, oh, damn, crazy. Imagine no. There we go. <laughs> oh yeah, we should level from this too. Because that quest line, I remember, has like some de decent length to it. I think it was like five or six quests. I say even if we don't level, it's fine actually. Like, why do I still have you on that? Some stupid.
Yeah, I was trying to remember what that did. I say, the only reason I'm not gonna go the whole two hours at the moment is just because, uh, well, either way it goes, I'm gonna have to render this video while I'm at work. This is definitely not gonna get done before I like leave for work. So I guess I will finish the last hour and just upload it tomorrow. I mean, no big deal, really. You know what's funny? I could have sworn that I could not be transformed because was I not immune to transformations? So should that not count? The um... Yeah, that should not count transform me at least the okay i've been lied to i've been bamboozled so that means i should worry about any boss that has transformation then because that is a fucking lie <laughs> Create more staffs, do your job. Now what I need you to do is like more. If I remember correctly, these eggs are like very annoying spawn rate wise. Like they take forever to show back up. So you kind of got well they have like a uh, multiple location spawn so they can either randomly spawn back in the same place or they'll just take forever to respawn or they'll just respawn in a different area is what i would say they'll respawn in a different area or they'll take forever or spawn in the the <laughs> I guess that is the right way to say that. Hold on, last, last try. They'll either respawn in the same area, or they will respawn in a different area. That is it. That's out of these. So it's pretty much at random between those. There we go. Easy. Okay, pathing. Hello. Now I gotta go talk to William. I think William will give me my six P, right? Oh no, actually he does. Thanks, William. 
Appreciate you, buddy. Now I gotta go fight the yellow monkeys. All the way halfway across the map. Oh, they're orange. Or brownish. Yeah, those are some sophisticated uh, monkeys. Motherfuckers carrying around armbands like a fucking gang. That's crazy. Never mind, I didn't read the blood soak part. Never mind, they, they smack some poor dude up with their fucking armband. Are they wearing them? I <laughs> never really paid attention to Grand Potatia's story because, you know, it's kind of all over the place. You're basically going on adventures. All I know is it is kind of dark as shit most of the time. From the stories I have paid attention to. Then it kind of gets confusing with the whole time thing, which I try and avoid getting into. <laughs> I definitely try and avoid getting into their whole time thing. Okay, and then we do this, yeah. Okay, so this is the last quest. We didn't level, but, you know, we're very close. And uh, I would say once we get to the dungeons, we'll definitely level. Duh. Obviously, you know. Obviously. And now we're turning this.
Hold on. Multitasking is still going on here. Alright, there we go. Anyway. And that's it. All right. Uh, first half of this video is done. I will see you guys after work. And I'll report some more. My brain will be f more fried than it already is right now. So looking forward to that. Fuck yeah. Anywho, to then. Peace out. See you guys in a little bit. All right. Um, I just got off work. And something interesting is going on. Channel 1. Is completely at max capacity. That is a first. Okay. Uh, channel 2 then. I was like, that threw me out. I was, I was here like, damn, dude, we were really popping off like that over here. <laughs> okay, that's going to stay on there. <laughs> How long is that going to stay on there? Is it going to stay on there until I get into the game? Do I have to restart the game? Hopefully not. <laughs> Surely. Surely I don't. Okay, we're good. <laughs> So to say, damn it. <laughs> okay. Now we have to do next dungeon. Okay, nice. It actually saves your, um, <clears throat> excuse me, your, uh, sprite buffs. <clears throat> Jesus, man. Freaking soul. Uh, I don't think there's really. I think we gotta do our here. Oh shit. Damn it, I was about to look at something because. Ah, screw it out. Let's get it later. <laughs> okay, anyhow. The next. Area. Oh god. Next thing we gotta do is um this map. Not this map, this dungeon. My brain cells are disappearing. I apologize, I started with like a throat clearing. I'm like Jesus. I've been doing like this healthy stuff to where you have to drink like we had to like put water and mix it with what was it two well one to two teaspoons of uh apple cider vinegar and mix it in as just like then you have to like drink it with a straw i say dude it it tastes so horrible but i feel more energetic <laughs> So I'm kind of, kind of doing all right now. Hey, freaking level up. All right, all right, all right. Now it's time to go to the dungeon. Is this the same one I'm thinking about? Oh, yeah, it is, actually. I thought it was a different dungeon. I thought we already did that one. But now I'm overthinking it. Like I said, I've been playing Grand Fantasia in, like, two weeks now. My All my brain power is, like, deteriorated. <laughs> so I can get back into the groove of that. Red Ridge. Out of Because I have to remember that we finished Condemned Mines first before we actually, like, started this. So hopefully we can get uh, the stuff we need in order to craft its cape. Get 
start doing that now. Ah, uh, it's not healed. Uh, so I need energy, not essence. I said that's the first thing I, first time I've ever seen a Grand Potato game. Let alone one of the private servers get like a full server and see that message. That threw me off quite a bit. No, oh, I didn't even realize I had a uh, had some of this. Is there anything on here that's actually good that I want? I don't think so. I mean, the rune. Yeah, the rune stones would be decent, I guess. I guess. Part of me kind of wants to just save it just because there's nothing on here I need. At least not right now. At least we saw that. There was something I was doing. <laughs> then I got distracted. Put these over here. I actually thought those were actually going there. I didn't realize they even got this. I haven't been paying attention at all. <laughs> Are these rewards anytime look good? Uh, I don't know, actually. It doesn't say. Oh, yeah, I was trying to um, put energy. Right here. Start searching for more. But I say, my soul. I don't feel like I did. Just a case. Double save. Alright, there we go. At least we didn't fight the lizards and accidentally kill them. This is where we start using XP's. Actually, starting to get a bar per kill. Hey, that's OS mission. 
That's a uh, next dungeon. Oh, you failure. You would fail that dungeon, well, that mission. Ah. Uh, every time I get you to the highest point. Okay, hello? I was about to say, can we bite him? Jeez. Every time I get you to freaking eight, the most the highest. Oh, okay. Shit. Everything is low now. Every time I get you to this mood, you always fell a lot more faster. I mean, I get more XP, but increases the chances of like. A failed event, which is annoying. Okay, nice, nice, nice. Sooner or later, we're going to be close down there, and that's going to be the fun part. We actually get to see what they changed on uh, Druid Talents for the forms. corner my weakness my only weakness oh the um about to say the insect dudes aren't here i guess they removed that which is interesting okay okay now they're green which means we'll probably get like a way less oh no we still actually get quite a decent amount I was about to say, please attack him. All I want is the essence. That's all I need. Well, the lost powers. Everything else you can keep. I just want the lost powers. Ah, oh, the Malice Staff. Okay. Normally I go Gorilla Form for things like this. But, like I said, we don't have, like, half of our stuff. But it is damage reduction, so I think we should be good.
The damage reduction is going to be freaking great towards end game. I don't think he's going to do enough damage to uh, actually like, kill us, though. Or get us low. I will have to start worrying about, like, other bosses soon. Like the one at the end of this uh, area. That's Reflection. If I remember correctly, I need these enemies for um, for a mission, so I kind of not don't want to kill them just to ensure it. Because it would be annoying to go through it again. Yeah, that's why I figured. There's more guards there. Uh, so you do get enough guards, but if you like start killing the whole room before you actually start doing that quest, uh, you won't have enough guards, if I remember correctly. That's usually how it goes. It's just easier to do this way than go back. That way you do have the guarantee. There we go. Okay, we're... 43. I think that's all of those. Yeah, we're caught up. We're going down now. I say if you're grouping up with a friend, it's always better to just send the friend like forward to grab the quest. I think you can share it with your friends that are in there. I think. It's a lot of or a kingdom festive candle. That's what I saw. I was like, a war kingdom. Wait a minute. Is every server doing the war kingdom related stuff? <laughs> and again, I, I remember playing a hell out of war kingdom because it was like extremely easy to get into. His late game was kind of iffy. But leveling up was actually like fun because it, you didn't have to try. I say it was just basic, basic quest after quest that gave, gave yeah, they gave you your level. You can move on to the next stage. You finish every quest there, you can move on to the next stage, and you were always like caught up. 
You didn't have to go through like a whole grinding phase in one area. Like older Grand Fantasia. Older Grand Fantasia was ooh, atrocious trying to level. Like you had to run a dungeon like so many freaking times in order to get that XP. That's why burning uh burning Kazla was like so great for getting to level one hundred. Oh, there they are. I was about to say. I was wondering if they took you guys out. They did not. But the only thing is dealing with these uh, minor dudes is that they respawn and they have actually a really decent aggro range. Was it really all the way back here? Wait a minute. Yeah, it should be right here. The language does not help. That's going to be a thing that's going to be very annoying. Is translation when it comes to like um, different servers. Because I can't remember what this quest wa wanted. Like I remember you just using it. And it finished a quest. I don't remember you had to have a certain number. Which is interesting. <laughs> oh god, hiccup. My soul. Okay, yeah, we're just gonna throw those out. It's not even important, it was just for like a little tiny buff. Oh yeah, they definitely increased aggro range inside of these dungeons, Jesus. That seems to be a common thing with uh, private servers, is that their aggro range is actually, like, well increased. Like, they actually respond to your presence. Versus, like, the official server to where you would have to sit there in front of their faces for hours for them to actually, like, notice that you're there. I was just a little bit of stretch, but you'll sit there for like a good, I don't know, 10 seconds, seven to 10 seconds before they actually like aggro onto you. But with them, I, I could just either sit there or I can walk through them and they'll be just be aggro. I could just be like, and there they go. Which I like because it makes, uh, it makes those pile up runs like a lot easier to where you're just trying to aggro every enemy in the dungeon and just kill them all at the end. 
I was like, their their AI pathing probably isn't all that good though. So I know the official server wasn't. I'd say they would get stuck on walls and everything and just go back and forth. Now there they go. I was wondering if I can kill them, kill that dude, like, within distance. Oh jeez, I just realized we're 44 now. I thought we were. I I looked up. I was expecting 42. Okay, that's a spirit, not what we're looking for. Don't these go in here? Okay, I was about to say. Take it up room better. Ah, oh, shit. I don't think it's that bad. Because I've only killed... I didn't kill all the, the little screechered things. Okay, yeah. I was about to say, wait a minute. I have to be extra sure. Uh, if I look correctly, these guys can be killed, but I'm going to go and double check. Well, actually, I don't have to double check. That is actually pretty far. I don't remember there being another quest for these guys. Oh god. I will say this, animations feel a little bit sluggish compared to, um, compared, no, oh, excuse me, Jesus, animation seems very, uh, slower compared to, uh, memories, like memories, I feel like my skills are going off instantly, and this kind of feels slightly slower. It could be latency. I mean, there there is a whole server that is like full right now, so I wouldn't be surprised.
the latency is definitely there, you can feel it. But that is what it is. Kind of wondering what build I want to go. Do I want to go full physical crit or full magic crit? Because crit build for Drew is actually like a lot of fun. Like big damage. But then again, I think. Eh. Or I can go a tanky build for gorilla form. And just pile everything into um, all damage reduction. Hey, there's the mastery system. So they haven't changed this much, it seems. It still seems like the same amount as always usually is. Uh, I'm more curious about these. Did they change anything? Still seems like the same old stuff, except for they removed uh, the plant thing, which made no sense to have. Like this right here was more damage against plant based enemies. So anything that had like a plant type here. Not anymore. Seems like that's gone. Okay, now the boss. I guess I should uh put a sight on him. Back to XP. So right now. I still don't get why we can't use these hammers as a druid. Here comes the reflection damage. See how much damage it does. Shouldn't do too much since we are. Yes, this is ten percent chance. And plus we're regening. So I shouldn't be afraid of it. Alright, 45. Okay, so we do have to hit the chest for this. So we gotta go all the way back here. Oh no, it's not that we have to hit the chest. It's that we have to turn in this quest here. Fuck. Because this quest has to go all the way back. Plus, you can't, like, escape this. At least I'm pretty sure that's how that worked. Oh, I missed you? Okay. 
It is weird that you choose English, but you choose English, but um, oh, it does give more attack. Hey, that's an advantage if you want to like deal extra damage and kill the boss faster. Only if you're only if you have the HP for it, but um, what was I talking about? I got distracted by that. <laughs> I have to go all the way back to him if this doesn't work. I wouldn't be surprised. If I do have to go back and turn in this quest. Then again, in, in the official, I don't remember that being a thing. I think as long as you had the key, you could go directly in. Oh no, you actually do have to turn in the quest. Okay. So the funny thing is, this... Running all the way back through the dungeon is the only way to exit this. Then I have to run all the way down, go to the teleporter, turn that in, then run all the way back here. It, so you don't need the keys anymore, but you do have to still turn in your final quest for that area in order to fight the um, end boss. You don't have to do this every time. Well, no. I'm about to say, of course you don't have to do it every time. It's just a one-time dungeon chain. But it is annoying. Hello? I, I clicked? Thank you. Jesus. Say so how many times do I have to click? But here's the thing, I can teleport all the way back with my uh, song. And if I had like a summoning orb, but I don't have those, so such. That's a lot of XP, brother. I guess that that's one thing that's going to be used for is getting the XP out of this.
wonder if I even make it. I don't really need crit damage for a uh, druid. Crit chance is good enough, honestly. Judgment. Oh, I forgot about that. It's going to be free. <laughs> this is still good, though. Because if you have two of these hammers, you have 30% cast time. So still pretty good for the human side of this. Not so good for the wolf form, if I remember correctly. We're just going to keep doing this. God, man. It sucks that the hammers are still shit. If I can rework every hammer, <laughs> I'd make separate hammers for druids and separate hammers for paladins and clerics. <laughs> this injustice of druids, though. I was like, we can't even use shields. Like I said, I wouldn't have a problem if we could actually use shields, honestly, but we can't. I don't love you, loser. I need to have to go get my skills up to date. As you can see, it didn't use any other keys. So you can clear the dungeon and uh, ask for help, and they could just, and players can just come right through and help you. I think that's what was in mind for that. Because most players who've already unlocked unlocked um, the dungeon and opened the chests and everything, got all the keys, or either just grabbed one key and then think they would need help, would be in a situation to where they have to get somebody to help. Oh, is that a book you just gave me? I don't know who the fuck that is. Keep your filthy hands to yourself. Um, hold on. Greg made that great. Ah, going to jail and they're clicking this person. This is interesting. Is 
Ooh. Collect Hurricane. Are you telling me to make Hurricane? Motherfucker, I'm nowhere near a Hurricane crafting. Don't tell me you're going to take Hurricane from me if I craft it. That would be some bullshit if you take Hurricane after I craft it. Because Hurricane is an orange and yellow weapon, is it not? I swear to God. Put that out. Put this out. Put that out. Goddamn. That's a lot of gold you got there, sir. 54 green hammer? Oh, you're smoking some good stuff. 44 green. What is up with you guys? Are y'all good? Ain't no way those things sell. Ah, here, here's what I'm talking about. These special, um, these special accessories that are acquired from, um, Spire. Some of them are good, some of them are not. They're pretty meh. I should have did that first. So now that I'm done... With that, I need to go to... Who was it? I'll say, one of you fuckers I can sell that. Oh, there you are. Ah, shit. Give me that back. Don't touch. <laughs> I almost goofed. Good thing buyback exists. I was crafting something. So that, so this, since we're focusing on the sprite for that.
Yeah, Hurricane. It is an orange weapon. You douche nugget. Who do you think you are to be requesting such a freaking hammer? Also, can this stack? <laughs> I don't think so. I said that tick can stack. That'd be that'd be freaking fantastic. Can't believe you asked for such thing. Damn it! Now I gotta bring up this too. <laughs> God damn it! I don't want to start crafting that stuff. I totally keep forgetting about that. Then again, I could go into Moonlight Forest and see if I can get that done there. All right. So, whoops. Grab this, grab this, grab this, grab this. This, this. Ew. I guess I'll grab that since, you know, it costs nothing. God, it feels great not to have to use, like, gold just to buy all those. Because that would have that been all my gold right there. Just purchasing that shit would have been all my gold. And it would have actually been, like, a very annoying nuisance of a thing that goes on. Well, we're going to buy all the bird form stuff. Hello? Yeah, I was about to say. Hold on, we gotta place... We gotta replace bird form now. There you go. Now we're gonna replace wolf form stuff. Alright, and there goes Gorilla Form's, uh, Charge Gainer. Charge. Oh. Uh, did I miss anything? Okay, no, we haven't missed it. We're good. But I do need to equip, uh, Power Wave, because... Grill form needs this in order to gain charge, so I'm just gonna go ahead and just pop that right there. Got to move that to the back. Uh, then the last thing is this shit. And when I mean this shit, I mean it, it's it's kind of shit. <laughs> the party, our party buffs aren't really all that good, especially uh, the sitting one. Because it does nothing for actual combat. You actually have to use uh, this one for combat and this one for a rest spot. To for everybody to regain their mana. And even then, it's not even all that necessary too. Because most people are going to be using potions and shit. So most of the time, mana source is freaking terrible. Because it's outside of combat. I'm happy that uh, the official server devs actually changed that to where it just actually normally regens everyone over time. So about the smell box, what's in here? Ah, oh, that shit again. Damn you. I was actually excited. I thought you were giving me something amazing. Ah, there it is. That That's what I was looking for. Duh. Of course it'll be in here. My dummy self over here forgetting 
that I already have it. So now I can't make this cape. <laughs> the cape I could have been made. Even if I fill this cape, it, it seems like I'll still gain and I'll still have enough. <laughs> God damn, dude, you you are really going to the earth side, aren't you? So now we can actually make our cape. Let's go ahead and make it now. Because with this cape, our power could bind 200 physical attack. I guess while that's going on, we can... Uh, and gamble our life away a little bit and trying to get that XP. Come on, XP. Okay, one more. Come on, come on. All right, all right. We got the XP. Fuck yeah. Oh shit! Damn, we uh, we just almost got ourselves into another level. Jeez. I think we're gonna actually make that. But you know what? Hey, dude, we got enough XP to almost guarantee us uh, the next level. You're done yet? No, you're not done yet. Okay. Well, the next area I guess we will do is uh, Plague Forest. Good old Plague Forest, man. Oops. Yeah, this place has totally not tried to kill me a couple of times inside of the, the official server. It's mostly that goblin boss, mage boss, is over here. That's nearly killed me multiple times in the older version when I first started. Because everything was like so confusing when I first started to do I was sitting here like, dude, what is all of this? My brain can't handle half of the things that you're telling me to do. So now we got our physical. I still don't know how the fuck am I getting more intelligent? Why am I getting intelligence when this is a physical oh no this isn't the physical cape oops i did a oopsie did i craft the wrong cape yes i did i craft the wrong cape we don't talk about the wrong cape all right you shut your face i i crafted the right cape that's all you need to see don't don't say anything about me crafting the wrong cape i did not i was just doing it for the xp yeah that's that's exactly what i was doing i was doing it for the xp you didn't see anything. If you said you did, I will decline all of that and say you're a liar. So, don't lie on me. <laughs> Son of a bitch. Uh... I have a lot of collecting to do again. That's great. That's great. This is your guys' fault. You distracted me. I, I take no... No accountability for this. This is definitely your guys' fault. I saw one here and I thought it was, you know, the cape. This is your guys' fault. You distracted me. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed. I will see you guys on the next one. Until then, hey, I'm back. It's good to be back. And uh, peace out. See ya. See you tomorrow. Yeah. See you tomorrow if nothing goes wrong. If nothing goes completely wrong. Something might go wrong. Who knows?